Hello, hi, happy new year everyone. Hope it's going good for everyone so far. Um, I thought I'd just tell you a little bit about the release that I've got coming up soon because uh, why not? So it's called Fuego, which means fire, and all the tracks are fire inspired. So there might be like the, the fire of anger or passion or of determination or just uh, uh, except there's one track called North Wind I've just noticed which is nothing to do with fire it's just let's call that one the balm track to soothe things out and then fire again ah. so um, yeah all the kind of artwork which Malki Kiri helped me with and did a great job um, the video that's going to come up as well for Yahweh um, is filmed in the very fiery hot Tatakoa desert in Colombia that we did on the budget of about two or three hundred quid in six hours using the driver to chase me around the desert because the dancer didn't show up um so when we burnt our feet at midday because geez sand is really hot in a desert at midday in colombia so that will be coming out at the end of the month um the ep is going to come out on the 20th um and you've just seen the little intro um track for the whole ep which just introduces you to the sound of it so basically, all of the tracks are based on sounds or rhythms that I heard out when I was out in Colombia. So, um, like uh, street musicians, for example, might be playing a little groove and I would record it on my voice note because I heard something in it and then took it home, wrote a song about it, and then it's on there. Uh, all the other ones are like, uh, I think there's a traditional uh, Gaita and Tambori festival. Gaita is this thing. Um, I can't even get it on the screen. <laughs> it's uh, bamboo and this is, it smells so good, it's beeswax and uh, that's a duck quill which I've broken I, but it still kind of works so you'll hear this a lot on there it's just like a <laughs> sound I know you might be like it sounds like a pump pipe but this ain't an album called Reflections this is Colombian indigenous flute, very powerful instrument, and then the people that play it there play it with such air. So I attempted that. I attempted to play lots of new instruments that I never have done before. Um, there's the tiple, the, the bandola, the tambor, and these shakers, which, you know, the, the little egg shakers that we get is one thing, but these Colombian shakers, they've all got seeds in, like toasted seeds. Oh, this one here. I just, um, so I, I kept adding and adding and adding and then by the end of it I had um, uh, some of them were like 150, um, two, I think nearly 200 track tracks because I just couldn't stop putting more drums on and making it really beefy so that's what you're going to hear and um, I, I have to attempt to make these big symphonic tracks into just me on a guitar and a drum when I go around Colombia in a few days. I need to pack. I haven't packed. I'm going to go soon to do a tour with my neighbour uh, and we're just going to go around nine different places and um, try and just um, give the EP a bit of life and give us a bit of fun. Um, I hope you enjoy it. Thank you so much to everyone who does follow me, like me, comments and stuff. I really appreciate it. I'm, I'm just having fun here. I'm um, going with the flow and just creating as I go. And uh, I'm sorry, it's not so much of a sing-along song EP. The next one I'm planning to do more kind of like guitar, vocal, song-based stuff. But this one I just really enjoyed exploring grooves and rhythms and different sounds and trying to build a song up from that. Um, uh, yeah. Just no idea how to do them live, but we'll see. I've got a few days. So uh, for now, enjoy the intro track for the EP. And um, please, oh God, I hate doing this. But if you follow me on Spotify, that would really help because it can get you playlisted really easy, stuff like that. So yeah, follow me in all the usuals would be really appreciated. Thank you, guapas. Ciao.